Hey guys, it's Mom from MGD. The previous video reached 20 likes. This is very awesome. Thank you guys. This means I will make a tutorial about Pisco. And here we go. This is the video. Let's get in and make some pixel art. I forgot to say that this video will be divided by two parts. So if you want the second part, just hit that like to reach another 20 likes. Okay, now let's get started and make some pixel art for games. Now, in the left of your screen, you will see the tools that you can use, like the pen tool, the mirror tool, the paint tool, okay. And in the right part of your screen, you will see the frame rate speed of uh, reading your animation, if you did or created one. In the layers, you can, I don't actually use the layers a lot. And there's a transform, um, like there are some tools which I will explain in this video. Here you have the palette, which where you can create a new palette. I will not create it now at the la at the end of the video. And the export menu, which I will explain later. Now the first thing you see here is, um, yeah, you can create another another frame, and you can resize your pen. Now the first tool is the pen, and it's very basic and simple to use, which is a pen. Yeah, it's a pen. You can draw with it. Yes. It's a normal pen. And then you have the second tool, which is the mirror tool. Vertical mirror tool. Which, basically, if you draw anything in the le at the left of the screen, it will be drawed at the right side of your image. It's really good to make faces. Now, let's move on to the next tool, which is um, uh, the paint tool. Um, you can just create a face like this. Then you can just use the paint tool and paint. I will change the color because I want a face like this. And then let's just add some, some eyes. Let's change the color. Let's add some eyes here. Black eyes and a face and a, and a mouth. Okay. Now let's go to the eraser tool. I don't use it a lot because you can simple, simply just right click using the pen tool because it's really easy and it's very basic. Now let's go and use the next or the next tool which is the um, line tool which gives you the ability to create a line. You can just draw randomly, you create a simple line and then let's go to the eraser tool and erase everything here then we will go to the rectangle tool which gives you the ability to just draw some you know rectangles that's why it's named rectangle now let's make a small or very big cube here yeah it's small now I want to make some eyes yep like this then let's move on the to the circle tool uh, I made a face here you can just draw a circle inside of another and use the move the move tool or the yeah the move tool to just move everything or anything around the screen now for the shape selection tool I will let it for the next episode I will not use it in this episode because it's pretty advanced no it's not actually all of this code is very basic now uh, we have here the selection tool I will leave them to the next episode too let's move now to the lighten and darken tool let's paint here and just make if you want to make your color or a part of your image darker you can just click control and just just left clicking and draw and if you want to make it lighter just click shift and just draw on the screen it will make the color lighter like this uh, very good now let's go to the um this tool too i will let it for the next episode let's go to the last one yeah with this let's go to the last tool here is which is um the color picker which you can just very simply and basically just select a color and it will be in your palette and you can draw using this color draw with this color like this all right that's pretty stupid but no problem okay now let's move on to the right side of your screen um in the right side you have the um, preview and the layers tab the layers uh, i don't use it a lot but i will if you want to know how to use it you can just 
make this video reach 20 likes. In the transform, we have four tools. Um, uh, the first one is the flip vertically, which makes everything in the light be the right will be in the left, and the it, it just inverts the picture. Now the other tool, which is the um, which makes the um, picture just turn around, like flips. Yeah, so basic. For this um, copy into the all of the other frames, I will just this tool. I will explain it in the next video too. Here you have the speed of your frame rate or frame speed. Now you go to the center tool. It sh there should be something which uh, have a, doesn't have a background. Like I'm gonna just delete the half of this face to just make it a simple small object like this. Then um, which this what this. Uh, this tool does is just centers the thing at the center of the image very simple and basic yeah everything in this app is very basic that's what i like um then we go to the palette uh tool which you can create a new palette here and just go and name it i'm gonna i want a green color but i'm gonna name it first tutorial no tutorial yeah then i'm gonna change the color because i want a green color like if you want to do a you just click save i did, forgot to say that if you just want to make a dirt dirt um lock or something you can just select your select your color from there and just start drawing yep it's very this app is very very good for beginners. I'm a beginner and I love it. I love it. I actually love it and I made very very good cool things with it. And I actually love it. That's what I explained it. It's for new people on uh, in making pixel art. So let's make a simple um dirt block here like Minecraft. Yep, draw the up of the image. So that's it basically for this episode. If you want the part 2 of the tutorial, just hit that like and make this video reach 20 likes. Um, you will help a lot. And here is our blo dirt block. In the next video I will teach you, or I'm not a teacher, I will just help you to know how to do an animation or maybe in the other, in the third part. So guys, that was it for this episode. Just like the video and make it, this video reach 20 likes to have the second part. I love all of you guys. Thanks for your support. Just don't forget to like this video and subscribe because we want to reach 50 subscribers this month. Thank you so much and bye.